I'm gonna have to fight. You know, you just never know. <laughs> you gotta swing my way, but don't believe that I bet. I'm all shady, so don't believe that I bet. Calling me splurge, let me jump right out the curve. Bet this might fly like a bird. Spin on the first and the third. Solid, I'm keeping my word. Can't be my equal, I don't know what you heard. Crack up the phone, I swear. Keep me a stick if they hurt. Young girl on one of they working my nerves. I'm about to pause and serve. Fucking this bitch on the fur. Smack from the back of a purse. Ice, the bird. Uh, Shitting on all you little turds. Can't take that way you turn. In my own life, we can't merge. So with no hands, you can learn. Let's see how much you can earn. Why me go get like the worm? And I ain't smoking no shirt. I'm in the BBP lady. QP. Keep I love my bitches, it's pretty, they showing their titties, it's up to the ceiling I let them run through a million, I rock with a really, let's fuck on the bed I'ma get down to the gritty, then fuck up the city, the home of the villains Hello y'all and welcome back to another vlog, I'm Leah, if you guys did not know already So, girl, I know it's been like a little minute since I uploaded a vlog I need to kind of hurry up and talk to you guys really quick I know it's been like probably one or two videos to upload a vlog but if you guys remember my previous vlog when i started the vlog about me complaining about me hating my job bitch tell me why i got fired <laughs> i got fired the next day like less than 24 hours of me talking about that i literally got fired that morning the next morning after i came home and i was talking to y'all and i was like literally like yeah I got fired, y'all. Honestly and truly, I'm getting burnt out with that goddamn job. I hate it there, like literally. Now, I don't know if I hate it there because I am just haven't had an off day and I feel my period about to come or am I just really burnt out? But a part of me feel like I'm just really burnt out. Like, I just feel like I can do better. Like, I just, I don't know. Like, now that I'm in my big girl job having era, I just feel like I can do better. And then I'm just not feeling comfortable there, like, no more. Like, I'm feeling, I'm gonna take my pants off. Oh, girl. I'm just feeling uneasy. Like, every time I walk in there, it's, like, uncomfortable for me. And that's how I know it's time for me to go. I've been there, like, five months. And I usually never leave a job this early. And, I mean, I'm not gonna leave yet until I find another job. Well, that's my plan. But I really, like, been talking to God and praying, like, God, I want something else. Like, I don't mind doing that type of work, but I just want something else. But we have an interview today. Um, it's kind of blowing my mind because like everything that I complained about and everything I was like, oh, this is what I want. This is what this job has. And it's like an, and it's like an immediate opportunity for growth at that. So, yeah, girl, we literally got to get on our Zoom at 10. Like, <laughs> so, yeah, I just showed you guys my morning. I'm literally about to open up the email to connect to the Zoom. Um, it starts in about 15 minutes. So, I'm just going to kind of, like, you know, pray. Um, they gave us, like, some little notes. I really, I looked through the notes, but I know I, I'm, <laughs> it's, like, hard to not be cocky. I don't want to say cocky, but I'm just confident that I'm gonna get it because I'm confident in this area of work. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, I looked through them, but I really didn't need to because it's like, you know, I knew I knew what it was giving. Um, but yeah, so yeah, we got an interview. I'll let you guys know how it go. But yeah, a bitch got fired, like literally the next day. So yeah, I'll let y'all know how it go. If I get it, I'm gonna let y'all know. If I don't get it, I'm gonna let y'all know. But yeah, y'all know jobs, you know, they coming down in the dozen, bitch. So, I mean, I wasn't too worried about it. I hated it anyways, y'all. I hated it anyways. I hated it anyways. Y'all know, you know, jobs come and go. But, yeah, and tell me why, as I'm getting ready, my old job texts me, like, it's multiple people, like, that will hit you up or whatever. Um, but my old job asking me, can I come in today because it's slow. I'm like, girl, I'm fired. Why are you asking me to come in? But yeah, let me um get this together and then I will um check back in with you guys when it's over. So yeah, wish me luck. I mean, by the time this come out, you guys will know already. But yeah, this is where we at. <laughs> we got the job, Bookie. We got the job. Okay. Period. Glass is empty, but cheers to that. <laughs> I know I was gonna get it though, y'all. Like, that's the thing. The interview was super easy. Girl, it just was so long. Like, 
that interview, because it kind of was like a group interview, they had like a presentation, all of the things, girl. That interview was like two hours long. Two hours long. So, let me just tell y'all. So, what time is it? It is 5.30. Last time I talked to y'all was like this morning. <laughs> so, I had like a little play. Y'all see me, right? You seen it. Y'all seen it. Girl, I ain't do shit. <laughs> after, after that interview, I literally took off that shirt, got on the couch in my bra and panties, poured me a glass of wine at like 1 o'clock, and scrolled and flipped through apps for about three hours. Okay, <laughs> I am just so, I, honestly though, like, just mentally, I have been so kind of exhausted. I've had my baby, she just left me like late last night. Like I'm talking about, I got her ready for bed and he picked her up after work cause he gets off late. <laughs> I've just been like, you know, trying to keep her entertained, having my own stresses, not stresses, but just mental, like just thinking like, what we gonna do? Cause like, I don't think, I, like when I say I got fired y'all, like I got fired probably like my third night in this apartment, like spending the night here. So just think about mentally where I've been, okay? Like we know God got me, but you know, you you know, but it's like when you know, like. So I just been so drained. And I think after that interview, I was just like, yeah, I'm finna chill. I feel like lately God has been in, in this era, like I feel like lately, God has been putting me in positions to just like, girl, just just relax, just just chill, just chill. You don't have to do so much all the time. And I see that as a sign, baby. When I tell you I was feeling my wine, I just was on the couch chilling, just chilling, just enjoying the quiet. Like I didn't turn on the TV, nothing. Like blinds closed, like just enjoy my place alone, peace and quiet. And that's what I did. Yes, honey buns, your girl got the job, so clap for me. We going up, like, huh, yeah. I'm so happy, so I feel so blessed, I feel so grateful, and yeah. So we are finna go on a walk, I'm not gonna take y'all with me because I'm not taking my camera outside, because I'm not going on a walk to like a trail, like I'm literally just gonna go take a walk, and I can't, ha just, I might have to fight. You know, you just never know, <laughs> so I, let me not speak that. But at the end of the day, I'm not carrying my this. I'm just gonna have um, just my phone and my headphones. And yeah, so we're gonna go take a walk. Like I said, I just wanna get my body moving, get some sweat. I'ma work out tonight too, cause y'all know I've been on the weights. We've been on the weights. Um, but yeah, I just feel like going to go do this. And then later on, we're gonna cook. I'm gonna make red beans and rice. We got a lot of chopping to do. I got chopped the bell pepper, the onions, sausages, like all that. We got all that to do. The beans ain't gonna be ready tonight. So I'm thinking I'm gonna make turkey burgers because I already took the turkey meat out yesterday. And if you know, you can't thaw tur you cannot thaw turkey meat out twice. Because I, I have a bad habit of that. I have like, oh, I'm gonna cook, thaw the meat out. And I'm like, nah, I ain't gonna put it, and I put it back in the freezer. I did that once before with turkey meat and it came out disgusting. So I have to cook that today. So I think I'm gonna make like these turkey burger sliders maybe I don't know and then we're gonna make that but I need to like clean like my place is not junky like it's not stuff all over the place before I like sat down and did nothing I like straightened everything up for the most part like I just need to like clean like do the dishes clean the tub clean the toilet but everything is put up in its place I just gotta wipe this mouth down I have it smelling good but yeah I don't know I'm in a good mood now. I got my offer letter and yeah, so we're gonna go on a little bit of exercise. Like I said, just to get my body moving, just to get me back flowing. And guys, yeah. Hey y'all, so it's the next day. Well, I'm lying. It's not. <laughs> it's so not. It's like who cares? Hey y'all. <laughs> um, so today is Monday. I am getting ready. My baby got a photo shoot today. My mom, she won like this um like free photo shoot. And it's like she get to dress up as a fairy and they have like all the stuff there for them. So that's what we're going to go do today. Um, I already got her ready. She don't really need nothing because everything is gonna be provided for her at this photo shoot so hopefully it's something cute something nice i'm excited for her when she gets dressed now she'll be like i'm a princess that's what she says when she gets dressed now so hopefully she feels like a princess um at this little function 
Um, but yeah, I ain't really been doing too much, you guys. So I haven't been really vlogging. I'm not gonna lie, like the pit, the end of last week, like I said, y'all know I, I got fired. So <laughs> I haven't been having, you know, like work to go to. And I don't know, it's, I've been having Mari. So it's just been us two girl. We, you know, go on our walks, go to the pool shit like that a pool party the other day my sister's best friend kara her um daughter's first birthday party was the other day and i would have vlogged that but i looked ugly <laughs> i ain't gonna like i was in a rush trying to get there it was a themed uh birthday party so i wanted to make sure that like you know i went with the theme so just trying to find stuff and just make sure you know mari was good bitch i ain't look cute at all so i ain't feel like being on camera that's just honest to God truth. I did not feel like being on camera. But other than that, that's really all I've been doing. Side note, I need a roll, okay? Cause I need to just be able to just, and do what I need to do. I be walking around this whole naked. And that, that's the problem. Cause it's my house and I live here. I'll get you bottle my wine in my house. It's my house and I yeah. I just need a robe to just put on to be, you know, just like I like just to make my breakfast, do my hair. Constantly trying to pull this towel up because I don't feel like putting on clothes, clothes yet. Constantly trying to pull this towel up is just not giving it. It's not giving. I need to promote my video. I'm trying to see do I want to put on some makeup? I mean, I guess I could do a little lash, right? If not a lash, I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, just getting ready. Probably gonna put on some makeup. Probably not. We'll see. What time is it? It's 12.33. I don't want to get caught up. Because it's like, once you start, it's like, once you like, oh, I'm going to just put on a little bit. Once you start, it just goes haywire from there. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, you guys. So, we made it to the place. Let it focus. So, we made it to the place. So, they gave us two. Um, they gave us two options. So she says purple and pink soon as she walked in. So as soon as they got as soon as we got back here, she went and grabbed this one. And they also have this one. And it's for a little Tamari. So, so I think we're gonna go with the purple one because that's the one that she um picked first. So I'm gonna get her dress. Say hi, purple. <laughs> Come on. Yes, I see it. What's wrong? You don't like it? <laughs> Why are you making that thing? <laughs> you know, headbands have never been your thing, so. <laughs> Bless, Bless you. you. You got a little allergy up in here. Keep sneezing. <laughs> Okay, princess. Say cheese. Say cheese. <laughs> no. She don't like it. <laughs> she does not like it. <laughs> Come here, baby. Bitch. You got a pink one? Yes. yes. <laughs> you got other options, too. She wants one that's maybe not as big. Do you have some? Can I see one? You guys. Mari is a trip, okay? When we first got here, so I couldn't take you guys in there with me because there's no cameras in the photography room. But when we got here, she had everything to say. Everything was pretty. I'm a princess. She sang, she named all the colors. She <coughs> named colors all day. That's her favorite thing to talk about is colors. And we get in there, she has nothing to say. <laughs> it was, took forever to get her to get to smile. But I think we got some good ones, but it was, it was, it was some work. So tell me why it is. 5.50. I didn't get up and start moving around and getting my life together until about 3.30. I literally, <laughs> I literally sat on my couch, laid on my couch, was on my couch upside down. All of that for hours, just scrolling. I didn't even go on TV, just scrolling. Scrolling, taking a break, taking a little nap, scrolling. I am disgusted with myself, <laughs> but y'all, I'm unemployed. <laughs> I'm unemployed, and the car is in the shop, and my baby gone. My baby is gone. Mm. She left at the crack of dawn this morning, so <laughs> so I'm, I'm 
I'll be chilling. I took advantage of this time and chill. It's certain things I need to do, and I'm gonna do them. I just did them like slow morning. I took it there. I took it to the extreme. Girl, bonnet still on. My bonnet don't never stay on this long. And I just, I don't know, but I'm up. I'm drinking my water. I got me a Celsius too. I like that I don't really finish these because they give me just the amount of energy that I need. So let's talk about it. What we need to do. Let me tell y'all. Did I tell y'all that my TV broke? The big one in the living room, it broke during moving. So I just have this TV right here. And see, this was supposed to be Mari's bed, right? But the wrong size was ordered, this bed is huge. But I already have it, so I'm not gonna give it away um, or like return it or anything because eventually she's gonna need this. And I have a storage closet outside. I'm just gonna put it in the storage and when it's time for her to have her room, we already have a bed, it's Minnie Mouse. It has the stickers, but we didn't, obviously we didn't put the stickers on it. She already knew what it was, she was excited about it all the things and it's been up like this for about a week two maybe <laughs> and it's time for this to get out of my living room because at first i was mourning the loss of my tv because this is how it was supposed to go my couch right here tv was gonna be up on the wall it fit perfectly like it was the perfect size tv on the wall that little thing right there um mari bed wasn't gonna be in the living room i just set it up in here but yeah, so this is the TV that was in my room in my old house. I kept that TV as well. But for now, I'm just gonna not have a TV in my room and put this TV in the living room. And I need to put this TV, get it off the floor, put it up there, move this bed, take, take this bed down, put it in a box, move this bed, move my coffee table up and move my couch up. Okay, so I was just thinking too. Okay, y'all, my couch, this is what my couch looks like. It's not, yeah, like, let me call my light. So, this couch, I honestly don't hate my couch. Like, I don't necessarily want a new one. I really just want to repurpose this. So, if I could just get some new inserts to make that look better, really get it clean, like, I don't know if I can shampoo the arms, get my cushions and stuff, like, dry clean, because I feel like it's a little brighter. I've had this couch now for two years and a lot has happened on this couch in two years so i just but i don't hate but it's like i don't hate the color of it like i feel like it's neutral i can do pretty much whatever i want with it and i like the size of it like i could fit my whole body on it <laughs> like so i'm not giving my couch away i just really want to invest in repurposing it so um, if you guys know how to do that, give me some suggestions. I looked on Amazon and looked like up couch inserts and what I thought couch inserts was is not exactly what it is. I think it's something to support like the base and I'm, I'm gonna get those though. I'm and I'm gonna get them, but I think that the couch inserts, they support the base like under the cushion so that your couch doesn't like sink, I guess. So I'm gonna get that as well. And if I can find a way to stuff this to, cause it's like loose, you see? It's like loose. Like it needs the the cushion need to move around. It's real loose. Like down here, see that? So if I could find a way to fill it up and really stuff it and get it right like a good pillow, <laughs> I want to do that. So we're gonna definitely try to figure out what can we do with the couch because I don't hate it. And then this time I want to get way bigger pillows. Like I want big pillows on the couch, real nice, real fluffy. I don't hate my coffee table either. The only thing I might, it depends, I don't know. But I might, because it's glass. This is what it looks like. I don't hate my coffee table. So I might just make it gold because of the way I want my living room to look. I might make that gold, but I don't know yet. We'll see. I don't think I have a problem with mixing the metals either, because I do want some gold in here. I don't think I have a problem mixing the metals, but I don't know, we'll see. And then my mirror, y'all remember my circle mirror? I put it right here by the door. So we have that, so you know, we're walking out, check ourselves real quick, boom, put that there. And then, I didn't tell you guys this, but, so those pictures that was in my old room, 
I put them right here in the kitchen. I really like it right here. Um, I really like these pictures. I got them from Ross and I don't know. I really like them, but I didn't want them nowhere in my living room and I don't want them nowhere in my room. I was either gonna put them in the kitchen or the bathroom. I said that as I was packing them up. So yeah, put in the kitchen. I really like that. Um, I have more of course to do with the kitchen, but I do want more of a black theme. I do want more of a black black and white kind of thing going on in the kitchen. There's nothing going on in my bedroom. So I ain't got no bed yet. But in, in due time, soon, we got a job. <laughs> we got a job. But we got a job, an even better job. So it's gonna happen, just, whew, whew. <laughs> So yeah, those were the apartment updates. Um, so yeah, we're gonna be on this journey together. It's gonna actually be a journey this time. And when it comes to my home, I really wanna make my home feel like a home. I did not do that in my last place. It was my first place, you know. My mind was everywhere. The people was all in my shit. I just, it was just so many different energies in my home. It just, it didn't feel like a home. But this house is gonna feel like a home. And I'm excited about that. Okay, y'all, uh, we finally got it done. When I tell you the last screw literally took me out, like had me cussing, had me mad, had me fighting the air, like really, y'all. When I tell y'all I don't do stuff like this, I don't do stuff like this. But I just had no choice because I got tired of my living room looking like that. But I'm gonna get my food. I'm finna get my food, girl, because it's ready. They told me, they texted me, told me it was ready 32 minutes ago. So I'm gonna get my food and then I'll come back and package all this shit up. But yeah, I'm back home, y'all. So look at my food. Look good as fuck, right? Got my fries. They got something new where they give you actually um, macaroni instead of corn, but I'm like, let me get a vegetable. So <laughs> I already started my corn because I'm just hungry. I just need something to eat. So I was finna get, dig into my uh, chicken tenders, right? And I look at my um, ranch, girl. Why is not even full? Like, hold on. Let me let me sit down. Cause maybe I'm tripping. I ain't tripping. Y'all see that? Not even full. I got these fat ass tenders over here. Fat ass tenders. But this little bitty baby thing ranch, like it's not even full. That just pissed me off. But I'm finna do my dishes, y'all. Probably just in my night here. I mean, I finally got this jacket. That walk from Chili's to my house was kind of scary, but I knew God got me. But yeah, finally took that thing down. Well, no, you know what? I'm about to put everything back into that box, figure out how to do that, put everything back in the box, do my dishes. And I think that's gonna be it for me today because I'm tired. That bed took me out. That walk, the workout, everything <laughs> just took my ass out. And, oh, sorry. And tomorrow, I still don't have an agenda. I mean, I have to edit. I need to edit a video and film some things to go into that video. But I don't have much of a, you know, schedule because unemployed diary. So, we'll send the, we'll send the desk tomorrow. So, yeah, you guys, that's pretty much it for tonight. Gonna figure out how to put this shit back in that box, wash these dishes, and eat my food. Period. Hey y'all, so next day, excuse the appearance, I'm doing my hair because I'm about to film a YouTube short. I have not done one in a long time, and I know I need to because someone asked to see like my clean girl, no makeup, makeup look, and I never filmed it, but I don't feel like it needs a full sit down video. So I'm just gonna do a short. And it might just be a long short, like maybe three minutes. Um, so I'm just gonna do a short. Um, because, because I haven't done a short in a long time either. So, hey, why not, right? It's on my mind to do it. So I'm gonna do it in this way. This is really like the Unemployed Diaries, bitch. <laughs> so y'all, I really got some news for y'all. That was kind of disappointing. So late last night, I was checking my email or whatever. And y'all know how I told y'all that I start my new job on the 31st. Girl, why they moved my start date to August 7th? So that's very much so irritating. Very much so irritating. But you know what? I'm, everything happens for a reason. Everything is God's timing. And I honestly have peace in that. Like... I really don't feel stressed at all. Like, I really have peace. Like, I don't know. And I, you wanna know how I know I got peace? I got peace and my hair ain't done. 
girl i got peace and my hair ain't done so that's how i know <laughs> that's how i know good things are coming you know what i'm saying good things are coming if that's what it has to be and i have to start later then that's just what it is i just gotta start later but um yeah but in spite of that i have been on my zoom today and i'm gonna continue to be on my zoom it's 12 o'clock right now I've been on my Zoom today. I did my Bible study this morning. Oh, it was good too, girl. I put the link uh, down. I listened to Pastor Keon, Lighthouse Church. I listened to his Bible studies. Um, I think, I feel like he be dropping one every day. Or maybe just time be going by fast. But I feel like I see the take action Bible study notifications like very frequently. So I just listen to them on my most convenient times. I started listening to them when I was working at that job actually. And they're actually really good. So I did my journaling. Um, did Bible study. Came in here, did my skincare. Now I'm doing my hair. Oh, now I'm doing my hair to film my YouTube short. And then I think I'm going to lunch or like late lunch with um my dad and my sister today i feel like this freaking blog is all over the place but hopefully y'all still watching and hopefully y'all bearing with me through this little time that i'm having you guys so don't film in the short i kind of had some difficulties filming it it was really hard to try to film fast like that like even though i edited it down even more to make it shorter it's just hard not to talk so much because i'm so used to chit chat get ready with me so when it comes to short form content you have to kind of get to the point so you don't have so much to edit and then like whatever but yeah the short was i filmed the short i think it's gonna come out good it just was kind of it was different to film but all in all we got it done so i'm about to meet with my dad and my sister for um lunch uh, my sister's gonna come pick me up we're eating with him at lunch we're eating with him first going to lunch then we're just gonna go to papa dolls girl if you're from houston i'm a papa dolls girl okay i never get tired of papa dolls okay like say what you want about papa dolls i know you know but i would never get tired of papa dolls the drinks be hidden and the food never disappoints so yeah, I think that's where we're going because I think that's where he said he wanted to go. So, yeah. Um, and then like, me and Jess are going to go get drinks and hookah after Papa Do's. So, should be pretty nice and eventful. I love going to lunch. and going to eat with my dad, just spending time with him. Like, that's my guy. I know my sister to get here. I think she touched up her edges because she asked me if I had any edge control. And then we will be headed out to lunch. So, yeah. 